It's down there. Yeah. Right. And what do you make of that analysis? All we need is, what is it, 20 or 30 seconds? And you do it in 28. And, and, we just, and we just kept going, and I think we made it beyond the 28 second mark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you, now you have to judge your estimate, don't you? Now, how good is your estimate in the dream? No, that's not the way you're right. We just need to go 20 to 30 seconds or minutes more, and it'll be okay. And, I, and we went beyond the 28th second mark. If you went beyond the 28th second mark, you're getting very close to what? 30 seconds. Thank you. So I was on the mark. Yeah. Yeah. Close to it. Yeah, okay. Now. One, two, this is the third. All right, the way you dealt with it is the fourth section. Right. And now, as it's most interesting in most dreams, let's just stay with the first scene, please. Well, that is uh, What I remember was I was joking around with some black lady about going to the bathroom. I don't remember. I just she was just a jovial lady, just laughing. Go ahead. And they, there were bathroom stalls, but they didn't. I couldn't. Put, I, the doors weren't visible. Mm -hmm. So it was like we had pulled. It's like we pulled out. <laughs> like the toilet was like a drawer and just came mm -hmm. out. <laughs> and it turned out to be. But they, but actually, I saw somebody pull open the door, and I saw, oh, there's the stall. Huh? But it was so decorative. It was very deceptive. Is that episode a success? There was uh, a goal achieved. Yeah, I, yeah. Mm -hmm. How did you achieve it? Um, you pulled out a drawer? Well, I, I was going to go ahead and... It was embarrassing because it was in public. No. Yeah. But then I watched somebody. Somebody had come out from one of the stalls, and I could see that the stall was hidden behind all this decorativeness. Right, right, right. right. Decor. So I said, oh, okay, well, now I can use it. Good. It's hidden. Right. Was that a success? Yeah. Right. right. Were you able to take advantage of what you saw? Yeah. Mm -hmm. True. Yeah. See, this, this is a success, too. One is a success, is it not? Yeah. Two is a success, is it not? Mm -hmm. Right. Three is another crisis, whether or not you should shoot them in the heart or not. Yeah. Right. You ignore it, you go along with them, and you achieve the goal. Four is a success, is it not? Yeah. We need to look at the different kinds of successes that these four episodes represent. And the first, what would you say, is the nature of that success? It's because you were able to do what? Um, well, I wasn't, you know, I, I went ahead and, and, and got involved in the situation. I mean, I, I said, okay, well, this is what I have to do, I'll do it, but then out of that, that Let's go over it again, all right? Okay. And stay with the question, okay? First saying, yeah. what was the cause of your success? I, 
was able to do what? Take advantage of somebody's, uh, what I saw. That's right, right, why? Right. So you could learn from what you saw, right? And the particular interesting thing is, the thing that you saw you had to see through, you had to see through ornamentation. A lot of it, yeah. Right. I mean, it was just, it just didn't look like a bathroom stall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk about the ornamentation. Well, it was like... Like what? Like a, it would be like... Reminds me of a cake. Uh, reminds you a of cake, what? A, decor a, de a decorative, decorative cake. cake. With all the icing all over it, and you never see the cake. You don't get to see the outline of the cake because it's so decorated. Mm -hmm. You don't know where the cake ends and the decoration begins. You don't know where the cake is, right? So it conceals. Is that right? What else? Come on, what other words? Conceals it. Conceals the outline of the door to the stall. I mean, you don't even know it's there. There's no, it, and the edge of the, you know, like the door opens and you would see a little crack or something, but okay. it's also covered over with this decoration that you don't see okay. in One. the end of it. Do the same thing now with two. What part of two, the raft? Same the question, place? same question. If there is a success in two, all right, what was responsible for the success? I took, um, I, um, I um, listened to the God. You listened before. You listened. One, I didn't listen one time. That's right. Um, See, the word listen is, is insufficient, isn't it? Of course, no. you're listening to sounds. Is that what you mean when you say listen? No. What do you mean? Come on, add something to it, then. Um, well, I tried everything that I knew and saw it didn't work, so this guy, I, I, I had nothing to lose. I had to, you know, it was like, okay. It's like completely exhausting all my, uh, what I thought was the way to go. And so I said, okay, well, I'll listen to you now. I dismissed it before. Three. Um, I just dismissed them completely. I mean, it wasn't even an issue. I just kind of looked, I think, at the woman and just said, oh, we don't even have to go this way. So the reason that was success because you saw you didn't need to go that way. No. So I guess that one came from myself. I mean, I could see uh, for myself it wasn't. Four. Four. Okay. That was, that was like a test. I can't hear you, please. That was like testing. That test. Like we got, we got in 28 seconds, and it was like a conclusion. Like um, I wasn't off. My decision in, in going on was right. Do you recall when you first stated the dream and talked about it? You didn't <coughs> have that opinion about number four, did you? No. That's the result of this discussion. In terms of the dream, yeah. how did you judge it? In the